Hey friends, Josh Brown with his productions coming to you with the July book of the month. As you know, if you follow me at all on social media, I love to read. I tell people all the time, hey, if I could just read all day, it would be heaven. I just, I really love learning. I love reading and uh, it's part of my morning routine. Every morning, I try to begin my day with a little bit of poetry and then I read the scriptures, the Bible. It's an important part of my life. And then whatever book I happen to be reading, I do this every morning, seven days a week, really important to me. The book of the month for July is called Atomic Habits, Tiny Changes, Remarkable Results, An Easy and Proven Way to Build Good Habits and Break Bad Ones. I'm not quite done with this book, but it's really fantastic. And I would just wanna read a little snippet of a section that really kind of resonated with me because I've got a lot of built-in checks and balances uh, here at His Productions that help us produce excellent content. And uh, the author is talking about something called pointing and calling, which is a kind of a redundancy system that engages all of your senses to reduce errors and increase efficiency. I found it just amazing. Some of the parallels in this system and what we do here at His Production. So I'm gonna read just a little snippet of this. The more automatic a behavior becomes, the less likely we are to consciously think about it. When we've done something a thousand times before, we begin to overlook things. We assume that the next time will be just like the last. We're so used to doing what we've always done that we don't stop to question whether it's the right thing to do at all. Many of our failures in performance are largely attributable to a lack of self-awareness. I'm finding as I'm reading Atomic Habits that that's really the main thrust of the book thus far, is just encouraging me to be aware, to be conscious, to just slow down and, and think about what I'm doing. What's triggering my behaviors? What kind of things do I wanna change in my life? What kind of habits do I wanna change? Because our lives are made up of our habits. The things that are habitual, the things that we do day in and day out, like I talked to you at the beginning of this video, it's a habit of mine. I don't even think about it. I get out of bed, I go, I start uh, pulling a shot of espresso, I sit down, I light my candle, and I start my morning habit, which is reading, spending time with Jesus. So our lives are made up of the habits that we have. So I would encourage you, pick up Atomic Habits, check it out. I don't know so far if it's a faith-based book, but really, really great content and a lot of scientific background behind what he's saying. So Atomic Habits by James Clear, the July book of the month. See you next month.